Okay, so okay, so this is still very much a work in progress, um, but the aim is to show you how we've got a, a robot connected via Bluetooth to um, a PC, another Arduino connected um, to the PC and the joystick on the on that Arduino. So the aim basically is to use the joystick to um, on one Arduino to control the other Arduino with the robot on. It's very much a work in progress. Um, still got a few issues to sort out, but I'll go through it and anyway how it works. So just to show you on the uh, webcam. So this is my robot. It's got a Bluetooth connection and it's wired up with um, the Bluetooth with the Adafruit um, Easy Link. It's also got a simple um, drive module, um, four pins, make too high and give them power, goes forward, make too low, make give them power, it goes backwards, one high, one low, turns left, other one high, other one low, turns right. Um, and here is my other, um, my other um, Arduino with a joystick on here. Um, I've had to use um, normal power connection here with an adapter. The battery isn't working effectively at the moment. I'm not sure why. Um, it said work in progress. So if I go back to my program, you'll see I've got on Arduino. So the program is go to Arduino 1. It's got a forever key and it forever sets two variables, one called forward to where A1 is and one called horizontal to wherever A0 is. And that's on COM26. I'm now going to connect my, on my other program before I show you. At the start, five and nine, those are the powers to each motor. So if they're on zero, no power. If one variable forward goes by 500, it turns pin 10 and pin 12 on. That sets motor 1 to forward mode, and that gives motor 1 full power. This sets motor 2 to forward mode, and that gives motor 2 full power. So if it's in off and off, that sets motor 1 to reverse, motor 1 to reverse, full power. This sets um, motor 1 of them in forward, 1 of them in reverse, and vice versa, 1 reverse and 1 forward. So in theory, if I do horizontal below a value, it will go left, above value, it will go right. Um, I'm going to connect my Arduino. I turned it off because it's once you, once you connect it, it gets a bit slow. So I'm going to select COM18, and now it searches out there. You should hopefully find COM18 in the moment. Yep. So now... The Arduino with the robot is connected via Bluetooth. I could use that as normal connection, but I'm going to use my other Arduino to connect it. So I'm going to press A. And now you'll see the variable change. Forward goes up, forward goes down. That goes that way and that goes that way. And now going to press space bar. And that means now there's a connection between the two robots. So fingers crossed, if I put my joystick forward, it goes forward. I do reverse, it goes reverse. I do right, it turns right. I do left, it goes left. Right a bit, right a bit more, forward a bit, back a bit more. It's still a bit jerky. So I've been playing around this morning, so it's still got work in progress. But you'll see that this is a joystick controlled robot with two Arduinos and it's via Bluetooth. It's still very much at the beta alpha stage because the connection sometimes loses the connection. Um, it's hard, we said I can't get the battery working at the moment, and it's a bit jerky response, but it's not bad. It is a, a 
robot. If I put my joystick there, there we go. If I put the joystick just there, you should see if I do that, I do that, I do that, and I do that. And this is using a program called Scratch for Arduino. Um, free download available, 1.6. And it's, um, yeah, it's simple and fun to use. Okay, thanks for watching. Take care. Bye. And we'll stop it.